and we can get started. Okay, so bear with me while I share my screen here. And Dr. Isaac, you can take it away. All right. Well, thank you guys so much for uh, the opportunity to share what I'm so passionate about, which is helping create automations and utilize a lot of the new strategies and solutions uh, that exist nowadays through AI um, and through uh, various uh, marketing and sales solutions and strategies we'll get into a little bit uh, in this presentation uh, for helping you guys help more people, serve more people, and transform more lives. As I think all of us have seen that the medical system is not really um, doing an incredible job serving patients uh, to help them create long-term sustainable results and prevent and reverse disease. So um, I'm looking forward to adding a ton of value to you guys. So if you go to the next slide, please. A lot of you guys may be thinking something similar to what I was thinking in practice, where I got out in practice and you know what I realized very quickly is I went to school to learn how to really help transform patients' lives. They didn't teach me how to run a business, right? And so I needed to learn very quickly how to figure out this whole system of running businesses and 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 creating transformations um, from a business perspective as much as I was in the health of my patients. Next slide. So you know this ultimately has resulted in a lot of doctors and health practitioners and health coaches even really having like inconsistent revenue, hitting a ceiling of growth, dealing with a lot of stress in leading and managing your team, uh, feeling like your business relies all on you or you're the center of everything. Um, you, you, you oftentimes feel like there's not enough time for your family or for ho your hobbies. I know when I was in early in practice, now I've got four kids, but <laughs> when I was early in practice, I was like, how do I have time to date any woman? You know, like I don't have time for any anything, but you know, this, uh, let alone have any hobbies, right? Um, and then a lot of you might be like, man, I'm not making enough money for the amount of work that you're putting in. Uh, and this all creates a lack of freedom, which is really what I want to help people build is I want people to have more freedom in their lives so that they can, um, you know, enjoy themselves, their family, uh, create a lot of that, um, that growth. So a lot of you guys may feel like you're in the hamster wheel. <clears throat> My hamster wheel was when I was um, essentially calling patients, doing all the marketing, doing all the sales, you know, seeing patients. Now I did have one of the highest revenue practices in the country of the, of its kind. It was a multi uh, disciplinary practice with chiropractors, uh, massage therapists, medical doctors. Um, and, and yeah, we did well financially, <clears throat> you know, so we were in the multi seven figures, but at the same time, you know, I was burned out, everyone else was burned out and we we're on the hamster wheel. And a lot of you guys feel like you're on the hamster wheel and you're not making the kind of revenue that you want. So, you know, this is one of the reasons why we put together this presentation with Practice Better, because I think there's a lot of synergy and alignment with the things that Brittany and I are gonna go over today. Next slide, please. So as you guys know, the traditional model of healthcare is broken. And it needs, you know, people to stand up and and take a stand for for what is, you know, going to be the future of healthcare, which I am I'm committed to pioneering with you. Next slide. So traditional model, it, it it leaves a lot of doctors and health practitioners exhausted. There's low retention of patients. You're working two times as hard in client attraction, or ten times as hard, oftentimes. Um, and it's, it, you know, really expensive marketing just to keep up because you're in what they call the red ocean. Red ocean is where everyone's fighting over patients versus the blue ocean, right? And the goal is uh, to get into the blue ocean and to access the blue ocean where people are, you know, coming in effortlessly. And I have a little giveaway for you guys or two things I want to give to you at the end of this presentation that will help address these challenges that will help to create more freedom, uh, will help you guys use AI, it's like a template to help you use AI to create more systems and solutions and streamline, um, you know, even your marketing, which has been really, really powerful. It's, it's a priceless tool that I can't wait to share with you guys. So 
Um, the question is, what if there was a better way? What, could, what if we could practice better, right? Next slide. Um, what we found is that the top 1% of practice owners are successful because they are modernizing, right? They're, they're moving along with the times. A lot of people are in the dinosaur times where they're not actually, you know, integrating and implementing a lot of the things that practice better now has. Um, and that is accessible to practices and health businesses all around the world. Uh, but not many people know how to put together. And so this is one of the biggest distinctions between um, all these practices that we see. We've honestly see over thousands of practices um, and, and the ones that are, 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 are really like struggling. If you go to the next slide. So we're on the cusp of a huge technology boom and it's coming to healthcare, right? Um, and not only that, there's a lot of things within healthcare that are shifting. So there's a lot of people after COVID that woke up <clears throat> to the traditional model being broken. And they're looking for practitioners like us to help, you know, take their businesses to the next level or take their health to the next level, which will obviously take our business to the next level. But <clears throat> there is a, a huge shift and, and they're, they're calling this a trillion dollar kind of like golden shift. Uh, or gold rush shift in healthcare away from disease care and into, into true healthcare. But people are looking for us, which is very exciting. But it's at the same time as this two, huge technology boom. So it's like a perfect storm, if you would. There's 25% of companies that are adopting AI uh, because of labor shortages. 64% of businesses expect AI to increase product productivity. Research estimates AI will create 97 million jobs. So it's not going to steal jobs away, but actually help create jobs. 97% uh, of business owners believe ChatGTP will help their business. The list goes on. Bottom line is that what we're seeing is that AI is already helping you expand your practice and you, you make the people that are working with you more efficient, more productive, and their, their, their hourly rate in respect to what they're earning for the business, right? Their hourly mate rate might be $30 an hour, but what they're earning for the business is skyrocketing because they're becoming more efficient and, and they're learning how to use AI, uh, which is huge. Next slide, please. So the good news is that our proven five-step system adopts, um, you know, really all these industry waves that I'm talking about, right? Um, and there's there's even more that I don't have time to talk about today, uh, one of them being uh, the longevity wave and people like really interested in regenerative medicine and all that, uh, which we're, we're leading the, the, the cusp of as well at HEA. Um, but, you know, this is what we, you know, what we are, are committed to. Next slide. So what is a modern day practice and how do I modernize? This is ultimately the proven uh, business blueprint for a modern practice, right? And it's audience attraction. How do you attract the right people? How do you, um, you know, authority automation? How do you build your brand to be the authority where you're generating, you know, impact and uh, a waiting list through your brand? How do you then get create what what we call the aligned selling method when people do come to you? How do you create alignment with their values, with their goals, with, with what they want to create and achieve with their health and have them sell themselves into working with you, which is an art, right? That a lot of people hard sell. A lot of people don't know how to sell. A lot of people get nervous around the sales process. You don't need to worry about that when you do it the right way. We're going to get into all this today as well as automated programs and residual income, right? So this is a modern day practice. If you're not creating automated programs where people are interacting with you, but on a virtual level where they're going through some video content of things that you say over and over and over again in your practice, or if you don't have some of these residual streams of income dialed in, then you ultimately don't have a modern practice. If you're not, you know, delving into some of the, the funnels that can help you to 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 really convert <laughs> and and attract people like you, you're going to you're going to lose a lot of uh of of traction and and not really take advantage of what I would consider the 1% club of practices that really understand audience attraction authority automation aligned selling as well as automated programs and residual income now the only way you can get to the last step 
And people that come to our events, they're like, oh my gosh, I want to be where all of your speakers are, right? And the speakers will be, you know, in the multi seven or eight figures in their practices and health businesses. And, and I'm like, look, they had, it, they don't understand the backstory of some of these people. It took them a second to figure out audience attraction. Then they needed to go through authority automation and, 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 and kind of optimize that. Then they needed to optimize their selling method. And then they, you know, developed a scalable solution for residual income and then the ability for you to scale your business, which is automated programs of residual income. Then you can reach asset ascension, which is where you work less, right? But you generate more because of the systems in each of the prior steps. And so, you know, this this is where ultimately you can get uh, when you have the right software, right? Uh, which is, again, why we're aligned with Practice Better and you've got the, the best systems uh, that you can integrate. Next slide, please. So this works for brick and mortar, right? Um, this works for hybrid and this works for virtual. Hybrid practice is really what I would consider also a modern day practice, which is, you know, also integrating some elements of virtualization uh, into their brick and mortar. And if, if anyone has been noticing or hearing, uh, you know, about possible future shutdowns and some of the, there, there's a lot of like conversation around that, um, you know, there's, there's countries that are, that are, that are creating like and putting billions and billions of dollars into like shutdown protocols and stuff like that. I mean, I think today, as weird as this sounds, and I can't even believe I have to say this, that we should be ready for whatever the world throws at us. Because I know that our practices thrived because they understood the virtual component of building a modern practice where they could still see their patients no matter what was happening in the economy or what was happening in the, um, you know, in, in the world. Um, so next slide, please. So this works for all of these types of practitioners, right? MDs, DCs, DOs, NDs, and NPs, PhDs, uh, PTs, DPTs. We've worked with all of these uh, people, right? Um, you know, it, it, this is really people that are committed practitioners and wanting to go to that next level of, uh, of, of success. Next slide. Thank you so much. So who are we? Health Experts Alliance. We really consider our, ourselves a future of healthcare and pioneering the future of healthcare. And we help create scalable, highly profitable health businesses without burning yourself out, which was my biggest thing when I was in practice. I was like, how do I not you know, get to a place where I have been in my brick and mortar practice, where I just got to a place where I was so burned out after just uh, you know a couple of years of practice, where I was like, how can I get myself out of this? Like, I, I do not want to do this for the rest of my life. And then obviously reverse engineered like a, you know, a really healthy business. Next slide. So we have helped over 2,768 health experts do this. And this is really the, the shortest and fastest path to success in business and disrupting the health industry through our proven practice scaling roadmap I'm going to get into right now. So here are some businesses that I've coached uh, into the seven, eight, and even nine figures. So you guys may have noticed some of these businesses, um, but a lot of these businesses, all of them really launched from uh, Health Experts Alliance. And some of them are in the eight figures. Some of them are in the, in the nine figures. Some of them are in the, um, you know, I don't know if any of these are in the, the seven figures now because they've grown. I guess, yeah, there's one of them in the multi seven figures. But I mean, there's some really unbelievable businesses, and this is just a selection of a few of them that we've supported and helped. Next slide. So just a little bit about me. I built one of the largest multi-million dollar brick and mortar health practices in America. Um, and I led clinical excellence and marketing and sales uh, in that uh, practice. And we got to 2,200 patients a week, which is pretty crazy with over 300 new patients a month. That was my job was to bring in new patients. Um, I pioneered virtual practice in 2008 because I was so burned out in brick and mortar. I scaled the seven figures while working with two patients um, or, or with patients only two days a week and traveling the globe with my family. I only worked Tuesdays and Thursdays when I kind of reconfigured a modern day practice and it was just glorious. <laughs> I'll tell you that much. Uh, since then, I've really helped a lot of businesses grow to the seven, eight, and even nine-figure range. Um, Dr. Axe, 
uh, Josh Axe, Dr. Axe.com, Jay Davidson, and a lot of my friends, they forced me to start HA to help doctors like you to get access to these trainings. They asked me to help them initially, and then I started helping more people because um, they wanted to know what I was doing and how I was doing it. So my mission now is to transform the lives of 1 billion people. And I will do this by essentially helping you expand your impact. So that, that's how I feel like I'll be able to do this. Next slide, please. I'm just going to hop in here to do a quick yeah. intro, just in case anybody is brand new to practice better. We've name dropped it a couple of times so far, of course, in this webinar, but uh, we're learning so much from Dr. Isaac Jones today. And we're going to show you not only um, the educational side of it, but how to you then take it and put it into action in your own practice with your clients. So we will have a, a bit of a segment today as we go through the webinar to show you Practice Better, which is a modern EHR. So kind of going along the modern practice, that's a nice alignment there that really helps support the health of your clients and your business. So very multifaceted in that sense. And it's a software that allows you to run your business, manage your clients, and all your uh, practice um, different components with features that are designed to be very automated, efficient, and time-saving. So again, a huge alignment here towards both of our brand missions. And so just sneaking in a quick intro there. And Dr. Isaac, you can keep the training yeah, going. You. Next slide. Thank you so much. Um, yeah, and I, we love Practice Better just because it's helped a lot of our um, doctors kind of integrate these five steps even more efficiently. So um, so the five steps, again, we went through this audience attraction, automate, authority automation, aligned selling, automated programs and residual income and asset ascension. Next slide. Um, and then what we're going to do is we're going to get into each one of these steps, okay? Um, and I, I want to get into... Uh, detail into one of these steps with you guys. Um, we don't have time to get into all of them just because of the time we have on the webinar. However, um, I think it'll add a ton of value to you. So audience attraction, the problem is there's a lack of proper messaging and targeting um, that wastes your time and money. And this is like one of the biggest things that we see is I see a lot of what I would consider a lot that one of the key villains in the industry is these agencies that will say, oh, we'll get you so many leads and we'll do this and that. And you spend thousands of dollars, a lot of people, tens of thousands of dollars, and, and you don't get any results. And so that's a huge problem. You end up selling to people that are tire kickers and will never buy, which is another problem. A lot of agencies or coaching companies out there, you know, they, they have a, a certain system, but then you end up working with a bunch of tire kickers. Nobody likes that, right? So the solution is implement one or more of the proven traffic drivers based off of your unique personality to immediately attract more qualified leads day in and day out. And you also wanna utilize AI to get quality rough drafts in a matter of seconds through audience attraction. And so I'll just real quickly share what are the um, you know, different marketing strategies specific to your personality. One might be um, you know, uh, uh, JVs, right? So joint ventures or some sort of like affiliate uh, system. I built over seven figures without one paid Facebook ad, without one post on Instagram. If you go to my Instagram, I've got like no people, right? And I built these, you know, multi eight figure businesses. Like how the heck do, do you do that? Right now I use both, you know, paid media and, um, you know, and, and uh, 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 affiliates, but you know, that is a really powerful strategy is to really develop and build an affiliate strategy where people are driving traffic to you and driving new leads to you all the time. Um, I just did a training on this for uh, the 40 doctors or so that were on a call a little bit earlier, but you really want to upgrade your messaging angles and branding for more effortless prospect attraction, right? And one way to do that via paid media for more than the more analytical personalities is a good way to 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 start you know marketing right so the, the there's a lot of different ways there's different personalities require different marketing if you're the one that's in charge of the marketing um and then if you're not then you know you can just pick you know the strategy that would work the best use, using um the the right messaging and angles and branding uh that we talk about so you end up getting more leads it fills your pipeline and you ultimately filter ideal prospects. Next slide. So authority automation. Okay. So the problem is 
Uh, you use scattered focus, hope, and pray marketing. It's expensive, right? Uh, you know, to build different websites, social media posting, expensive IG and Facebook ad agencies, podcasting, online events. Oftentimes, a lot of these things waste money and time. Um, this is not what our top clients do to build and grow predictably profitable businesses. So the solution is to build one automated education pipeline that frees up your time and filters only qualified, more ready to buy leads. Now, I'll just give you an example of this. With draxx.com, he built one funnel and his team just optimized and tweaked that one healing leaky gut funnel. And it was all about leaky gut. And people are like, how did he blow up? Well, he focused on one funnel and they just completely built that brand to the next level. And one of the things that the marketers coached our, our um, you know, community on was, hey, like if I had more time to focus on this funnel, we would have made even more money. You know, we would, would have impacted more lives, which is so counterintuitive, right? Um, the, the same goes for so many other people. Like, you know, if you go to Jabin Moore's Facebook page or Instagram page, uh, Dr. Jabin, like his whole thing is Instagram and his he's got that one focus and he gets 70 to 100 new patients every single month with that one automated education based pipeline. And it's freedom up and it's really filtered a lot of that qual qualified, more ready to buy leads. And now with AI, you can actually use um, chat, which is so cool. This is like, literally, we just beta tested this this month and the people are raving about it, um, where you can literally can set up sales calls through AI. AI is the one that's doing all of this. And they set up sales calls um, and people are booking all these sales calls with AI because it flows the exact scripting that would that would optimize for you know back and forth via Facebook or Instagram or whatever um, and communication with people via DMs and it's like it's really powerful. So ultimately, authority automation builds demand. They get it and then they want it. Right? They actually want to work with you. So this is just an example. Um, you know, uh, uh, what, what, Doctor Kim, what he did was he for years tried to figure out how to market on Instagram. He built a big following, but he could never monetize it, right? So we taught him how to build one, you know, pipeline, right? This one pipeline that he's he had built with other agencies that didn't work, right? But he got his messaging and his angling down and he he didn't, you know, optimize it. So we 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 worked on this, you know, he launched it the very first time he had 601 signups. 108 live, and he had uh, 58 paid consults, generated close to $100,000 within just a, a short period of time, like uh, uh, just one or two months or something like that. And and this was this was like literally just taking what we teach and then, um, you know, uh, moving that forward. Uh, yeah, so um, let me just see. Okay, Holden, I think you've got, uh, you've got that in respect to the chat. All right, next slide, please. All right, so it's a line selling method. So a lot of people, they the problem is they they have high pressure sleazy selling that doesn't work. And it, and and this is honestly the, the the practice management company and the business uh, coaching that I got. They taught this, and I would do this with patients, and it made me feel so dirty. And I'm like, there's got to be a better way to sell. There's got to be a better way to like get people to move forward working with you and convert even at a higher rate. And so, um, the, again, the problem is if you don't know how to create alignment with your prospects, it will not only cost you money, but deny people the opportunity of working with you and having their lives transformed. So the solution is by following the proven aligned selling method, which is a more of a Socratic method. It's a it's it's asking questions and 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 getting them to sell themselves into what you're doing. Prospects understand the severity of the problem and then how to, how your solution is the perfect fit to getting the results that they desire. So it really ultimately motivates them to take action, which is the biggest problem. There's all these objections in 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 prospects' minds, but when you uncover the the pain and you give them a proven solution, they essentially sell themselves. Next slide. So here's what we want to talk about today is automated programs and residual income. We're going to get into a little bit more of this today. Next slide, please. So imagine shifting from one-off visits to creating a high-ticket automated health program. Automated health programs and residual income are 
like what I have been known for in the industry. Um, and, and it doesn't necessarily mean that you're not interfacing with people, right? Some people choose to do the group coaching route and they're interfacing with one to many people and other people choose to do high ticket one-on-one -on -one and then they downsell into lower ticket programs that are more economical for the people like my mom and my family growing up where we were very poor growing up. And um, the, the, the doctor that transformed my health had a scholarship program or had like a lower price point program that my family could afford. So that, that was really nice, but you know, ultimately, you know, there's different ways to market to different people and different demographics that come in and work with you. And a lot of you have this oatmeal approach to working with people and you don't have higher price points or lower price points that you can maximize conversions and even build residual income. So problem is you don't know your value. A lot of you don't know your value. You waste a lot of time trading time for dollars and you've not made your business work for you. Rather, you've been a slave to it. The solution is build simple high ticket programs and more economic downsell options that will allow you for you to convert anyone at any level, depending on what, what they can invest. So you want to really help them program or you want to programatize and package your knowledge and health solutions for residual income. And I'll tell you, there's some people out there that have multi eight figure. We're talking about, they're going to probably hit $70 million this year where they did not believe all they worked with was chronic disease patients. They're like, there's no way that that I can programmatize my knowledge because I have to customize it to each person. But he programmatizes and then taught his coaches how to customize within it. And then his business completely exploded, right? So I just want to let you know, like you can, if you're a, a, a clinical genius, which I know a lot of you are probably on this call are, you can still programmatize and create customizations and it be like outstanding in respect to the, the, the results that you get. So the, another solution is become the business owner versus the business operator by automating your programs and residual profit streams through using uh, our system and, and really dream team hiring guide to find the right people. Um, so there's a way to find the right people. Big problem in the industry is, man, it's like a, a revolving door for our talent that, that we hire and then they leave or um, like we, we're not getting the right people. Well, there's a whole system around, you know, in the health space, attracting the right people. Next slide, please. Thank you. And what are aligned health programs? Well, aligned health programs are are programs that will take people from the red and the yellow and the and the orange, right? And they'll bring them up into the the blue and the light blue, right? Well, we want to get people symptom free. And we want to get people into the optimal state of health. Like we are a tribe of people that are not just about detoxing, right? Because what happens when you just detox? You re They retox and then they, they need you again, right? So you want to help them uh, fortify their bodies, fortify their organ systems, their, their cellular health. And, and, and prevent the retox effect from taking place, which is what 95% or above of our industry end up doing. So a lot of us will bring them up in the blue and then they'll drop down in the yellow or the, or, or the orange again. And so we ultimately are committed as a whole tribe to getting people into the, into the blue and then the light blue, right? Get back, people back to a homeostasis and then light blue. Thank you for the comment, by the way. Uh, agreed. That's awesome. Any, any, um, feedback I can get from you guys. Uh, do you guys agree with this approach? Let me know in the chat. Uh, next slide, please. Um, so traditional model versus the aligned health model. A lot of you guys get this treating symptoms versus cause prevention performance, drugs and surgery versus lifestyle change, cellular healing and detoxification. This is one of the reasons why practices can go, you know, not just statewide, but countrywide and even work with people in different countries is because we work with people on the different tools, right? A lot of the, the, the legal issues come when you're trying to, you know, do uh, uh, drugs and surgery across state lines. But when you're working with people in the aligned health model, you can start working with people across state lines and in different countries. Um, so one size fits all, customized, personalized, reactive, reductionistic to proactive and holistic, emphasizes genetic predispositions versus em emphasizes epigenetic control. And the traditional model, here's what I communicate very well to my patients, which I think you guys need to learn how to do as well, is show them how expensive the tra traditional model is. Paint it out. Show them how expensive diabetes is. 
you know, uh, uh, cancer is, heart disease, et cetera. One in every two people get cancer. One in every two people die from heart disease, right? And I mean, these are not just multi six figure diseases. Some of them go into the seven figures as far as out of pocket expenses. So what I believe is that what we do is extremely affordable. Even if your program were to be a hundred thousand dollars, right? It would be even cheaper, right? Or more economical than them moving the, the traditional route, right? That's a mindset shift that a lot of us have to have. Next slide, please. So examples of aligned health programs, weight loss, pain management, longevity. Longevity is a, a huge one. And I believe longevity should go into every other program. And I think longevity should be also, whatever your niche is or who you're helping should be part of your continuity. Because when people finish your program, they get results. You want to sell them into some sort of element of a continuity program, which I think that longevity plays a really good uh, role in. Reversing diabetes, fertility, gut health, autism, parasite cleanses, autoimmune disease, sleep disorders, hormone imbalances, um, you know, emotional trauma work, nutrition, fitness, Lyme disease, the list goes on. Next slide. So what we want you to do is get to the three quarter mark. And this is where a lot of people are, you know, when, when you talk, when we talk about, um, you know, uh, uh, there's audience attraction, but then there's there's the ability to scale your business and, and get to that asset ascension. You have to get to the three quarter mark in the Pareto principle. It is a principle. It works, right? It's, it's a huge in business, but you have to get to this three quarter mark where you get 80% of the results for 20% of the effort, right? You have to build the first four steps, but you got to take action on building the, the four steps. Then you have to configure um, and configuration is all about testing, right? It's about like, is this, you know, working with the market. Is this what they want? Right. And then once you figure configuration, then you get into acceleration, which were, is where your brand and your business goes um, really through the roof and you start generating more revenue. And then you get to the three quarter mark and that's where you hit the scale, right? Where your systems are working for you and you can reach, you know, that asset ascension model. And this, this is a 10 X kind of, uh, you know, model that, that I, I wrote down, but I wanted you guys to see when you implement the other four foundational steps, how you can get to a place where your business is running without you. And you're essentially the owner versus the operator. Right. And I believe a lot of us can get there. Next slide, please. So our proven automated programs and and uh, a system really helps to create residual income. So what I recommend for all of you guys is to build some sort of a three month or six month or nine month or twelve month you know core program. It's like your signature program, I call it, right? And what I've always had since two thousand and eight is is a six month signature program, which is an aligned health program. And then once they finish, you can either add monthly extensions, right? Where it's a three month extension, a six month extension or month by month if they need more support, or you go into less kind of a lighter program that's an annual continuity package, right? And this, again, we miss out on, 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 on this. And if you think about the customer acquisition costs, nowadays it's getting higher and higher. So it's more important to keep people that you're already working with than it is to get more people to work with. Um, so that that's that's a really big, again, mindset shift and decision in your business that you have to make. But by adding monthly extensions and you know, continuity packages, it's a great way to do that. Next slide, please. So this is the AI workshop. We have outlined an automated health program, you know, workshop, you know, for you guys. Next slide. Um, and this this is what you do with ChatGGP. So you tell ChatGT about your protocols. I'm going to tell you a few things about the protocol I typically recommend for my health participants. And then you answer these questions. What is your niche? What supplements will you recommend participants take? What types of meals do you recommend your participants take? What six habit changes do you recommend for your participants to take, right? Um, and this, you, we just put into the chat a free resource for you guys to get access to so that you can download and um, and, and then utilize yourself so you can get uh, results in building out your own program. Next slide, please. So an example is I'm a longevity practitioner. I'm going to tell a few things about the protocol I typically recommend for my health participants. This is obviously simplistic, but I wanted to give you guys an example. 
my my niche in longevity for my my niche is longevity for entrepreneurs. Uh, the supplements I recommend is Coenzyme Q10, resveratrol, et cetera, et cetera. I recommend my participants go on a paleo or paleo adjacent diet. I recommend that you don't eat within two hours of going to bed, consistently get uh, eight to nine hours of sleep, minimize EMF radiation, et cetera, et cetera. So put in your lifestyle strategies there. Um, and then I would like you to outline a six month health program. This program includes coaching calls once per month with a practitioner, supplement recommendations, meal recommendations, structured habit change education with a focus on a specific topic each month. So literally you, and obviously you can put as much into it as possible. Now you're going to get a rough draft of what your program is going to look like. Next slide, please. So this is what um, this, th oh, the tips for success here. Treat AI like it's a new team member. You need to really uh, fully onboard your team member before you can produce quality work. A lot of people don't work well with AI. It's because you don't give them context. Everything about AI is about context. Give them a ton of context. It'll spit out better results for you. So chat to GTB loves context above uh, uh, overall things. So the more you tell it, the better the results will be. You can give it specific feedback about your content and general feedback about structure and what it generates for you. Ask for revisions until it's at a quality level that you want. So make new custom uh, or new conversation threads for a project and then ultimately keep using it. You want to get better and better at using it. Next slide, please. So the results, this is just an example of some of the results. Establishing the foundation um, so it gives me a month one, right? It gives me a month two with different, you know, meal recommendations, supplement recommendations, structured habit change solutions. Next slide, please. And, you know, to take it to the next level, use that the, the, the clean life uh, inside of practice better to create nutrition plans based on the response. So I'll let, um, you know, Brittany talk a little bit about this. Um, have it right onboarding or support emails for new patients and automate them to send out over the length of the program with practice better. You can do this all with practice better and add an AI chat support bot for routine, uh, for, for routine questions. So this, uh, provides faster response times, allows you to support them 24 seven, you know, and, and really helps to curate a five-star experience. Next slide. So this is where I'm going to hop in quickly and yeah. share how we can take uh, those examples that we just learned and um, show in practice better how you can make that happen. So bear with me for a second while I do a little switcheroo of our screen share and take us into practice better to see this all in action because we've got all of this amazing information and we're gonna use that longevity example that Dr. Isaac shared with us. Um, so you can all see my practice better screen now. Yeah. Great. Okay. So uh, we're in the practice better platform and we're just going to do a really quick kind of deep dive to show how once you get all this response from the AI tools, how you can start to package it and actually bring it to your audience, bring it to your community, charge for it, collect payment, all of that good stuff. Um, so first and foremost, we're of course going to need to create kind of the, the foundation or the structure of the program, and we're going to do so under my practice here and in the programs section. Now, as I mentioned, um, we're gonna use a longevity example, but know that you have kind of three different styles of programs in practice better from what we call fixed state, evergreen, and self-paced. Today's example is evergreen in that you can continue to market it. People can sign up at any time, but you can always kind of duplicate and have iterations so that you're not starting from scratch every single time. So once I've prompted with the AI tools to kind of figure out what that signature program looks like, I can start to kind of create the structure with just building out these basic frameworks and inputting the content and tweaking it as I need. So I've used those prompts with the longevity um, and I've got all of these different modules that have been framed out for me. So this is a six month program that I've created and I've chosen to have monthly modules, but of course you can set the cadence and however many modules you want, you can decide when you want them to be released, things of that nature. 
One thing that uh, I will point out is as you're going through the motions of using practice better to package this all together, you'll often uncover more prompts or more opportunities to use AI to support your work. So you've got that great foundation with the prompts that um, Isaac shared with us. And now you can do things like help me write a short description for this particular module and help to kind of expedite this even further. So um, each module within your program will have this overview where you get to create the name, the description, set when it's going to be released to your clients all in an automated way. And then you've got various different tabs to complete um, to your own discretion. So however robust or simple you want to make these, maybe you want just a meal plan, maybe you want just a few tasks, or maybe you wanna focus on the education side of things, with each of these modules, you get the opportunity to choose what you include. So this is another place where as you're coming up with the um, content for the plan and you you're looking to educate your client, you can use those AI tools to help you support that and build out what feels like a really robust module. So let's take an example um, and show you quickly kind of how that can look like as you start to build out some of these um, content sections of your modules. Tons of different tools that you can use to um, provide education and resources to your clients. So anything from embedding videos that they can watch directly inside Practice Better on the go or on their computer. Um, and then, you know, educate the client, include different images, make it feel bite-sized. That's one thing that I find, you know, doing these webinars and just in life in general, we're all consuming such short form content that um, you can really kind of take your message if you feel like you're being long-winded and ask ChatGPT to make it even more bite-sized for your clients too. So, so many opportunities as you're starting to work with the software that you'll uncover to continue to use AI tools to support your work. So again, using it like a team member, like Dr. Isaac said. So let's head back to quickly that longevity program example here and take a look at some of the other components that you can include within your program and where you can start to package up all of these different pieces that the um, that you've generated with chat GPT or through other um, AI tools. So um, we'll look at the second module here where you know we can add things like tasks. So what should the client be focusing on? What should be their primary priority? Where should they be um, spending their time and energy? You know, we're teaching them so much that oftentimes it's hard for clients to take action when they're sifting through and trying to disseminate like what the biggest priority is. So this is a fantastic way to do that. Kind of acts as like the homework or the to-do list for the client. You can include forms and worksheets. So, um, you know, if you wanted to do a midway check-in or an assessment form, you could do it at the beginning, middle, and end for the client so that they have these benchmarks of their own progress. You can include protocols. And protocols in practice better are a fantastic place for you to house all of your different recommendations together. So things like your dietary, supplement, lifestyle information into one really convenient place for the client. And you could even choose to just operate off of a protocol like I'm about to show you and packaging it with sessions. So, uh, you know, there's different ways of structuring it. You can name these protocols, set the focus, protocol notes, again, use the AI prompting to help you do that and highlight certain food recommendations. So here's another great place where you could, um, you know, for recommending a paleo or a paleo adjacent diet, come up with a food recommendation that you'd like to include and then use AI to help you come up with the explanation. So creating that logic for the client to help them support the behavior change, which can be really difficult for some people and come up with a whole host of examples. So when you deliver this to the client, it will be nicely organized. They'll have the rationale, they'll have examples to really kind of create the framework for how they're going to structure their diet. So we're not only providing them a meal plan, which we've done too, but we're giving them the pieces and the education so that ongoing long-term, they have the information they need to be successful. If you have integrated your account with that clean life, you'll be able to add nutrition plans. So either collections of recipes or um, structured meal plans to protocols or program modules directly. And um, this is fantastic because again, once we learn from the prompting, you know, what to include, what not to include certain things, we can just use all the different tags available to us through that clean life and start to either look at collections that they have pre-created 
or individual recipes where we can go through and really work with um, the recipes to provide to the client. So all of the different ingredients, the instructions, the grocery list will be provided to the client through their protocol or program. And they can take this on their phones. So if they're in the grocery store, accessing it through the Practice Better app or on their computers, sometimes they can even download it or make edits depending on the permission levels that you grant, but they're gonna have everything that they need in one place. And these are all recipes that have been created um, by um, people in the industry and vetted by the registered dietitian on that Clean Life's team. So a fantastic tool. We also, of course, learned when we were doing our prompting about all the different supplements that we wanted to include in our signature program. So I have built that out. Now I have my Practice Better account um, integrated with Script. So what's even better is that this is a secondary revenue generator for me um, when I have that online dispensary, but that's optional. But my clients through this can even shop through Practice Better and have the supplements show up right at their mailbox. So super convenient for everyone involved. And you get to make these fantastic recommendations that you have learned through your prompting. Um, and it will even come up with a really convenient schedule when you deliver this to the client. So the client will be able to see what time of day, how much, et cetera, that you are recommending for the client. And then lifestyle recommendations. So we're taking everything that we've learned and packaging it into one really convenient place for the client. Um, alongside everything that we've learned today with Dr. Isaac, I think another thing is really making sure that uh, when we're thinking about this, this system and this modern practice, that we have to meet clients where they're at and it has to be convenient, accessible and actionable for them. So this is really helping to put everything together in one convenient place. So um, that's the protocol. And as I mentioned, you could deliver this as a standalone or you could choose to in this um, example here, attach it to the program module so that the client has all of these different resources and engagement tools at their fingertips. Um, again, you could choose to do the nutrition plans directly to the module. You can even do a quiz. So something that's fun or something that is really actually serving that purpose of assessing their knowledge, um, that's totally up to you. This is also a fantastic place for you to build out um, check-ins and communications to the client where you can use AI to help you draft that communication too. So while we have what is called a content module, we also have what we refer to as email only modules as well. So if I wanted to be, um, you know, talking to my longevity program participants and I wanted to make sure that I'm not having to carve out time every single week to draft those communications and send them off to every individual person, I can even create what's called um, an email only module. Let's go back here. Create new and we'll go to email only module. And again, if I have, you know, a midway check-in, I can do that where I can start to draft the email with the help of an AI tool. Of course, I can edit it as I see fit. I can use placeholders in Practice Better that's going to uh, take the client's information from their records so that it feels very personal to them. It won't feel like it's necessarily going to the group. Make sure that things are nicely formatted. And then with just a few seconds, what I've done is I have you know, set all the communication um, for the entire group that's going to go out at a cadence or a time that makes sense in relation to the rest of the program. Um, so, that is going to just be a really efficient way that you can set all this communication right at the time that you are building your program. Okay, so there we go. I have just created that. And again, keep in mind that you can use these different um, AI tools to help you draft all these communications and then edit them as you see fit. And you'll find opportunities to include more and more practice better features. So using the custom forms and waivers section to build out those assessment or check-in forms so that you have one uniform place, one consistent type of source of truth for all your program participants. And you'll be collecting that information. Everything will be stored in the client records um, as well. We can kind of take this one step further to make this feel really comprehensive and still, as Dr. Isaac said, feel like we have the ability to cater to those individuals to some degree by offering the program alongside some coaching sessions. 
So first and foremost, build out that program as we just took a look at and use those tools to support that work. Next, create your service. So within the services section in Practice Better, think of those as like the individual appointment types. And then we can package the two things together. So we can take that longevity program that we've created and we can even package it with some um, sessions here. So we've got uh, the 60 minute monthly coaching call. We have six of those included in this package alongside the program. So this is going to allow the client to purchase the package together. They'll be automatically enrolled in the program, have access to that content, and they'll have the ability to book in those virtual monthly coaching calls with you where you get to set, say, the expiry and the cadence so that they're not um, you know, dragging out this package indefinitely or longer than you'd like. So kind of a crash course of all the different ways that you can take this, package it up, and start to use it in practice better. Once you have those things built, it's as easy as just grabbing the link. Um, so we'll go back down to the package here because that's where we've got those two things together. And we can share this link. Now, anywhere that I'm marketing out my program, my signature program, whether that's my newsletter, social media, et cetera, I can put this link. It will lead to a registration page where they'll be prompted for payment. They can pay in full or an installment plan um, that you set up and they're off to the races. So it can be a very automated, structured system, and you've got a ton of tools to help it make it feel really efficient. All right, so that's your that's your kind of crash course. We're gonna go back to Dr. Isaac here and share um, how all the rest of his amazing information. So bear with me Thank while you. I get our good job. I love I love that you know what what you guys will what you guys are doing and 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 the 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 amount of time you put into putting all this together is incredible. All right. So um, I've got a couple of things I'm excited to give to you guys. There's a coaching, um, a free coaching thing that I'm wanting to give to you guys that goes through this in more detail, like all the steps that I just talked about. Um, but I just want to uh, share a couple more things uh, with you guys. So next uh, slide, please. <clears throat> oh, am I on the right? Deck. Oh, here we are. Okay, good. So, you know, I believe that, you know, you will save a lot of time and money if you follow this roadmap. I know that some of you guys were like, hey, you know, I want to learn more about AI. Well, I've got a whole course on AI that I'm going to give to you guys for free uh, in just a second. Uh, so you guys will be able to literally go and workshop through all of these different steps um, in, in a moment here. Um, next slide. <clears throat> But um, this is just one example. Um, Dr. Olivia, she said that this was during COVID, by the way. They were um, they were able to take their virtual programs and supplement sales and break 100K per week. And she was able to build over 80,000 per month in residual income um, where she said she's positioned for growth in any future shutdown, which I re referenced a little bit earlier. Um, again, we don't know what is going to happen with with the economy uh, and and with the you know with with this day and age, but we have to be prepared by modernizing our practices. Next slide. <clears throat> and so the reality is, without steps one through four, you can never reach asset ascension. I'm going to skip asset ascension real quick. So if you wouldn't mind going to the next slide, because uh, I did talk a little bit about it in the last uh, last section. So we at Health Experts Alliance, for those big thinkers out there, we've helped seen over a billion dollars in health business exits from companies that we've coached and trained through supporting uh, people get to asset ascension. Next slide. And this is uh, Reagan Archibald. He's the author of uh, Peptide Protocol. He said, by implementing Dr. Jones' roadmap, we went from 90% in person to 75% virtual and we're able to expand our impact while growing our revenue to eight figures. Next slide. So now that you know essentially how we have built out our proven uh, 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 roadmap to, to build health empires, you've got two options, right? You guys could essentially um, go on next slide. So the first step is you, you can ultimately, you know, uh, try to implement this stuff on your own, right? Um, this is essentially why I wanted to uh, share some of this stuff today 
and also give you access to a free coaching that goes into more details into all these steps. Next slide. Or you could obviously work with us and shortcut your results uh, by, you know, uh, following our proven practice accelerator. Um, so next slide. So my gift for you guys, um, I know there's a lot, uh, and I know that some of you guys are like, hey, look, all I want is just value on these calls, <laughs> which I totally understand. But this is my first time connecting with you guys, uh, and a lot of you guys have not met me uh, before. So there needs to be a little bit of context around how we've gotten amazing results. And I want to give you guys the opportunity to go deeper uh, into all these pillars. So um, I'm going to give you a five days of free training. It's practice growth training with me. Um, we want to teach you more about the four pillars and then all of the different uh, AI strategies that will help save you time so that you can go deeper with this content and information. And as a bonus, we're going to, you're, you're also going to receive an AI bundle uh, workbook. Next slide. And the next thing that we're going to give you for those that are interested is a one-on-one -on -one practice growth strategy session. So for those that are like, Hey, look, I love what you're talking about. I love your story. I like the, the the brands that you've worked with and how you've helped them grow. Um, and I'm interested in learning how I can I can grow and scale my business, understand where my uh, kind of downfalls might be or blind spots. You can connect with one of our team members, Corey, Wynn, or Ryan, uh, and they'll be able to help create a lot of clarity around that um, and how you can take your business to the next level. Next slide. And so this is everything you get. You get the five days of free practice growth coaching with me. Um, I think you're going to get a lot of value. Some of the people that were wanting to learn how AI can integrate into all the steps uh, even deeper. It's very hard to do that in a, in a one hour call. But uh, if I have uh, one hour per day for five days with you guys, you guys are going to see some amazing, amazing growth. You also receive a bundled workbook, uh, a bunch of amazing AI workbooks as well as a one-on-one -on -one strategy session from my growth experts. So go ahead, click the link in the chat. And thank you guys so much for jumping on today. I hope it added a ton of value to you. Yeah, and just before we sign off for the hour, thanks everyone. We have been recording, so everyone will get a copy of this to their inboxes um, within the next day or two. And as a big sincere thank you for everyone carving out time in their days, uh, we do have a special offer for those who are new to Practice Better as well. Um, you can use the code HEA20 to receive 20% off for four months on any paid plan. Now, uh, what we took a look at today in, in platform, um, you would want to use likely the Pro or Plus plan uh, to access the program's feature if that part appealed to you. Um, you do start with a 14-day free trial, though, so you can bounce around the different plans and see kind of what best resonates with you. So um, don't be afraid to, to take advantage and give that a try when you're putting all these pieces together. And we'll remind you of all of these amazing offers and how to access them when we send the replay out as well. So thank you, Dr. Isaac, for being here and sharing all of your incredible expertise and wisdom with us. It was so fantastic. Thank you and so much. Appreciate yeah, it. Thanks everyone. Have a this fantastic. Was fun. Yeah, have a fantastic rest of your day, everyone. Bye. Bye, guys. Thank you. It says, hey, just.